Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Mario 64, and how are all you lovely people doing today? I am doing just fantastic. So, we are going to get started with the next course, which is Tiny Huge Island. Tiny Huge Island is a lot like the uh, World in Super Mario Bros. 3, where everything is gigantic. So basically, the gimmick of this world is when you see these warp pipes, those warp pipes switch off between basically huge and tiny. So right now we are in the huge portion of the world. And the first mission is to kill all these big piranhas. Piranha plants. Excuse me. So, we'll uh, kill this one. And then we can... Grab our star. There it is. That was the last one. So beautiful way to start all the video. A quick, a quick star. About a minute into it. Uh, this is probably. Uh, I don't like this world, but I don't hate it at the same time. It's just kind of like one of those neutral worlds that just have to be done in order to uh, complete the game 100%. The uh, second mission is the tip top of Huge Island. Now there's a way for you to get up here without having to go all the way around. Like that. You 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 can be able to backflip up when you're in small island. So basically what you want to do is head into this warp pipe and then you will be transported into huge world. This is what you need to this is the, you need to be in the huge portion of this world to do this uh, mission. So once you do that, just follow where I'm going up the mountain, and then you'll see a box. Hit the box, and there's your star. Two stars, two minutes. Can't get any better than that. All right, guys. So you might be wondering, uh, where's the game audio? Come on, come on. Where's the game audio? Well. I was recording this and I had the Dazzle volume all the way down because I was recording another video that will be seen in the future. So for the next uh, couple videos, for the next three videos after this, I'm um, sorry guys, but uh, there's not going to be any game audio. I'm going to put some background music in, but other than that, there's there's not going to be any game audio, guys. I really apologize for that. Like, it, it really makes me angry that I did that. And it was completely on accident. I'm really sorry, guys. But, uh, the third mission in Tiny Huge World is a rematch with Koopa the Quick, and he has gotten a lot better. He has with his new running shoes and this being his home course he's gotten a lot better guys see he's going pretty fast but we still beat him we got him so he'll poop out the star again just like before and just go ahead and grab it that's the last we'll ever hear from Koopa the Quick so now we are going to go back into the tiny side of Huge Island. By the way, there's this little small side, and then on the other side, there's a big side. Like, it's a really long pathway, hallway kind of thing. And, um... Basically, if you enter the big side, you'll enter in the big side, and if you enter on the small side, you'll be in the tiny side. So, it's really no big deal. What we wanted to do is go back inside the uh, the tube and do the trick to get on the other side. No, I don't want to do that, stupid Mario. So, go back into the tiny side and try to do that shortcut. Oh my Jesus, oh my bejesus, I'm going to kill someone. Are you kidding me, I can't get back up. There we go. Oh my god, I'm gonna kill someone. Someone's gonna dive.
Yay! Alright, well basically, uh, we gotta get the secrets. All the secrets. Uh, there's five secrets. There's, there was one of these in Wet Dry World. Um, I really don't like these missions. I find them kind of annoying. But, you know, whatever helps game developers sleep at night. I mean, they they developed a fantastic game. So, you know how that goes. So there's number three. The third secret, if you long jump over this away, you can get number four. And then number five... If you head this away, there's number five, and the star will appear. You can only get that star in Tiny World, so be careful, guys. Uh, I tried to actually make a jump there, and that's just not gonna happen. You could go for the long jump. I just don't feel safe. And now basically you just go into huge world. And where's the switch? There should be a switch here. Maybe it's only in tiny world. Yeah, the, the platform's not even there. It must only be in tiny world. That is my bad. So, you will reappear here. Then you can press the block, jump, and grab your star. Very cool. So I think we're going to do at least tops, maybe one, maybe two more missions. We got plenty of time left. Wiggler's Red Coins. Alright, this one is kind of annoying. So what you're basically going to want to do is you're going to do the shortcut again. If we can get up there. Oh my Jesus. Oh my Jesus. Oh my God. Mm. This is what I hate about this shortcut in this place. It's aggravating. I just don't like this place at all. Like, what do you guys think of this course? I really hate it. I really just hate this course. That's better. So now we're getting Wiggler's 8 Red Coins. So, what you're gonna wanna do first is you gotta talk to the Pink Bob Bob. Because you can't do this mission if you don't talk to the Pink Bob Bob. Then, what you're going to need to do is go back into Big World. So once you go back into Big World, you can fly your way there. Oh, damn. I tried to do a long jump, but that didn't work out. Um... Ah, whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, not, since we got the, uh, the bob -omb guy, we don't need to go back into Tiny World, so we'll just start her off in Big World. Now you, now that you notice, like, everything's bigger now, you can pass through entrances, and, s I mean, you're the small little midget owl thing that, uh, Everything, like, everything's bigger than you now. It's basically what I'm trying to say here. So then go in the cannon. And then basically what you have to do is just shoot yourself all the way up. And once you shoot yourself all the way up, kill this guy so he doesn't get in your way. And then 
you have to like balance yourself here. Be careful. Don't fall like I just did. That's aggravating. Can I get back over there? No, I can't. Alright, that's a shame. That really makes me angry. I don't want to go back up there. You know what? I'm actually going to call it a video. We'll finish this mission next time. See you guys.